Um, we got Derek Williams returning. I think he has the most starts out of the group. He's a two-year, um, has started for two years on and off, uh, mostly been a, a third or fourth wide receiver. He's a guy that I'm looking forward to seeing if he can step up uh, and become a, a major player for us, a guy that can win consistently on the outside. Uh, he's been consistent his whole career, and we're just looking forward to seeing uh, this spring if he can make that jump and, and replace you know, an Ansel Ponder or Randall Hawkins. Uh, Ryan Stewart was a guy that was hurt last year, had 10 touchdowns as a freshman. Another guy that we're counting on to uh, continue to, to improve and get back to that level of where he was at. Uh, so this should be a big spring for Ryan. I know he's anxious to get back on the field after his injury. Um, DJ Holmes is another guy that's, that started a couple games for Randall last year. Uh, it was a, a very close race between him and Randall last year as far as the competition goes. Uh, so DJ should be the guy that's ready to step up uh, on the outside and, and help replace Randall. A uh, different type of player, more of a, of a, uh, a guy that, that does a lot of things well, uh, is, a, is a threat to uh, you know, make plays downfield, uh, and also uh, does a great job in the blocking schemes. Uh, Tyler Smith is another guy that has some starts um, and is a returning uh, starter, started the last four games of the year. Another guy that we're counting on to step up, uh, become a player, uh, plays the slot and plays outside, does a great job blocking, uh, can make plays down the field. Uh, so we're looking forward to uh, you know, seeing those those four guys right there really step up, uh, this being their third season, and, and really become big players in this league. Uh, another guy that played a lot last year was Tico Henderson. Uh, started a lot of games in the slot. Uh, did a great job on special teams, so he's another guy that we want to see uh, if he can compete and become a starter in the slot position. Um, Colton Cox is a guy that, that has a little bit of experience um, and does a great job in the slot. Can also play outside. We're looking to see if he can develop into a player. Um, Davon McGill and Daryl Thomas are two younger guys that uh, did a lot on scout team last year, show a lot of potential, and uh, you know have a chance to become starters this year. They'll be competing uh, with Derek and DJ respectively, trying to uh, earn a spot on the outside. Uh, we'll probably try both of them inside in certain formations. But those are two guys that we uh, think have the talent to be uh, big time players in this league. Uh, we just need to see if they're, they're ready to step up and uh, accept that role, and, and if they're confident enough in the offense to, to do that. Uh, we have some other younger guys. Brandon Toller is a guy that showed some promise uh, two days last year. And uh, a couple other guys. Casey Cottrell was a young guy last year who's still developing. And then Messiah Quinones uh, is a guy that, that showed up this spring that's done a great job in the weight room. We're looking forward to seeing how he does uh, and hopefully add some depth to our position. Uh, I think the, the position in itself, uh, we got some experience. We, we do have some depth. Uh, what we don't have is, is the, those premier guys uh, yet. Uh, I think Ryan Stewart was that guy a couple years ago. Uh, we're waiting to see if Derek, DJ, or Daryl, or Davon uh, can step up and, and maybe accept that role. Uh, we're, we're looking forward to the spring. I talked to him yesterday. We only have four touchdowns returning from the room. We lost Ansel and Randall, as you said. So someone's going to have to step up and, and make some plays for us outside. Uh, but all guys that are returning do a great job blocking, have great effort, great attitude. So uh, it shouldn't be a problem for the uh, improvement. We just need to see who can step up and consistently win matchups outside.